Hello everyone. So here in this problem, we have to find out the acute angle between the lines 2x plus 3y equal to 5 and 3x minus 2y equal to 6. Now to find out the acute angle between the lines, we have the formula that is tan theta equal to mod of m1 minus m2 upon 1 plus m1 into m2. Now to use this formula to find out the acute angle between the lines, we should know the value of m1 and m2 where m1 and m2 are the slopes of line 1 and line 2. So to use this formula and to find out the value of angle or I'll say acute angle between the lines will first of all find out the slope of these two given lines. So let's start. So here I'll say let L1 that is line number 1 is 2x plus 3y equal to 5. So the slope of line number 1 that is slope of L1 is equal to M1 which is equal to minus of 2 upon 3. So here I am using the formula minus A by B. Similarly, let's say the line number 2 is 3x minus 2y equal to 6. So therefore, the slope of L2 that is line number 2 is M2 which is equal to minus of 3 upon minus of 2 which is equal to 3 by 2. So here we got the value of M1 and M2. Let's assume the acute angle between these lines as theta. So here I'll say let theta be the acute angle between the two lines. So therefore using the relation tan theta equal to mod of m1 minus m2 upon 1 plus m1 m2 will get we will get tan theta as mod of so m1 minus m2 m1 is minus 2 by 3 minus m2 is 3 by 2 upon 1 plus m1 into m2 so m1 is minus 2 by 3 and m2 is 3 by 2. So by solving this we will get tan theta equal to by LCM here we will get minus 4 minus 9 upon 6 whole upon here we can cancel 3 as well as 2 so here we'll get minus 1 so that will become 1 minus 1 now we know that 1 minus 1 is 0 so in the denominator we'll get 0 in the numerator we'll get minus 13 upon 6 and in the denominator we'll get 0 and whenever we get 0 in the denominator that time the value becomes infinity and therefore the theta will be tan inverse of infinity and we know that tan inverse of infinity is pi by 2 or 90 degree. So the acute angle between the two lines is 90 degree or here I can say that these two lines are perpendicular to each other. Thank you.